Welcome to Coffee Break, Five Minutes with God, Five Minutes in the Word of God, Five Minutes designed to taste and see that the Lord is good. I'm going to begin reading in Psalm 138, verse 1. I will praise you with my whole heart. Before the gods will I sing praise to you. I will worship toward your holy temple and praise your name for your loving kindness and for your truth. For you have magnified your word above all your name. In the day when I cried, you answered me and strengthened me. And you strengthened me with strength in my soul, he says. You know, when we pray, God hears right away if we are Christians and we don't have any unconfessed sins in our life. He hears us right away. And he answers us right away, too. Believe it or not, he answers yes or no. And even when he doesn't seem to be saying anything or showing us anything, he is answering by saying, wait and trust me. Sometimes that's his answer. And maybe most of the time, his answer is, wait and trust me. Verse 4. All the kings of the earth shall praise you, O Lord, when they hear the words of your mouth. Sooner or later, all people, including important political leaders, will know that God's word is as good as gold. Sooner or later, everyone will know that God keeps his promises and God executes his threats too. It may be too late for some to do anything about their situation, but they will know that God is a God of his word. Verse 5. Yea, They shall sing in the ways of the Lord, for great is the glory of the Lord. Though the Lord be high, yet has he respect to the lowly, but the proud he knows afar off. This is one of my favorite things about God, I would say. God is appreciated by those who recognize how infinitely great he is, but, and how he is. And yet, in spite of his greatness, he cares and he honors the humble. In spite of his greatness, which is beyond our ability to even comprehend or measure, he cares for us and he honors the humble. Jesus says, if you want to be great, then become a servant. That pleases God, because that's how God is. Just imagine it. The God of the universe, the God who created everything and sustains everything, including our lives, is a humble God. And he does the work of a servant, clearly seen when he became a man and died on the cross to pay for our sins. No wonder he likes us to be servants. Isn't it great that we have a good God? Isn't it great that we we have the kind of God that we have? He's perfect in goodness all the time, in every way, from every aspect. God is great because he is God. But he reveals part of his greatness and his love for the lowly. Study all of the Bible with me and learn about that God at the BibleVerseByVerse.com. Study Genesis through Revelation four times at your pace, at your convenience, using my audio Bible messages at the BibleVerseByVerse.com. To be a part of this ministry that has been faithfully teaching the whole counsel of God for over 35 years, pray for me and God's Word. And click the Donate button at the top of the front page at the BibleVerseByVerse.com. 
and prayerfully give us. The Lord may lead. See you next time right here on Coffee Break.